So tell me exactly what I need to form and how I need to do it. Okay. Okay, first of all, press the record button on the camera. Okay. And then? Got that on? Oh, I think so. I think I just got it there. I just can't turn it in my pocket. I'm so excited. <laughs> Oh, that looks great. But you need your hair sticking up a bit. Yeah, do you want to brush your hair? <laughs> no, not bad. Oh, no, <laughs> please. Oh, that looks, looks good, great. eh? That looks amazing. Those colours look fantastic. Oh, there. Okay, hello. Hello. Okay, first of all, what we're going to be doing is saying Lachai. What are we going to do after that? Okay. Then we've got cayenne pepper, salt, olive oil, chicken stock, cumin, garlic, green pepper, tomato chopped, and fresh garlic cut, and tomato paste. And then we've got the eggs. Now what we're going to make is called shakshuka. Okay, come around the side now. the olive oil in the pan, which I've already put, because of, okay, we won't say anything. Okay, then we put the green peppers in. I think you need to turn the heat on. Yeah, it's on. Morning, one. It's on. You can already smell how delicious that smells. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, while we letting that cook, we'll have a lachai. Okay, so now we've got the green peppers and the tomatoes. Cooking in olive oil. Oops, delicious. Okay, then while this is cooking, we still have another in the <laughs> Okay, now we can add some tomato paste. Any tomato paste is good. Mix together. Okay, now we can add a bit of cayenne pepper. Just a drop and some cumin. Mm. Can you smell it? Yeah. Nice, eh? Very good. Delicious, eh? <laughs> huh? Huh? It smells <laughs> divine. Of course it is. Okay, now we're going to let that cook a little bit, but we should add a drop of water in it just to give it a Bit of a saucy, can use this to add a drop of water. Okay, just to give it a bit of paste. Okay, now we need to add some of the chicken stock.
stop. Chicken stock to give it flavor. Ooh. Most of the time. <laughs> okay, we've got some more water. Mmm, <clears throat> smells good. Of course. Then we need just to put a, a drop of salt. Let's just give it a taste to see where we are. How's it taste? It's so perfect that I think what we can do rather instead of salt is a little bit of Johnny Walker black label. Yes, it's my that's the lecker. Okay, then we got the eggs. Right. What can we do? So it's still air. Yep, you can see. Do you want me to come closer? Here we go. How does it smell? It smells divine. Of course it does. <laughs> okay. Now we can add the eggs. Okay, this is... See, the longer this takes, the more you can drink. So never rush it. Okay, now we need to break the eggs into the sauce. How nice does that look? Divine. Delicious. Okay, now, there are two ways of doing it, which I prefer to do this way. Or you can just close it and let it cook like that with the eggs as one piece. Or you can be like me and get some of this just to... Now, 
This is the trick. Okay, bring the camera. Okay, with a spoon. Make the white without touching the yellow part of the sauce. So it's breaking the white away from the yellow. And there you have the perfect shakshuka. Are you supposed to make the yolk cook properly? Yeah, you cook the yolk now. Depending on how you like the yellow. I always cook it till it's hard. But as you can see, the yellow is now separate. I'll be careful not to break the yellow. Okay, then now this can be served or in pita or on toast. It's also nice to serve it with some hummus on the side. And there, my friends, is the perfect shakshuka. <laughs> And that's how it looks. Yeah. And then you serve it in? Or on toast. Or you can put it into pita bread with some hummus. Or just as it is with a nice glass of wine on the side. And rice? Or no? And the best is, no, not rice. This isn't Chinese. 